Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Gretchen, from Gretchen's Bakery. I'm just in time for your New Year's Eve party. I'm sharing my recipe for sausage stuffed mushrooms. This recipe has been with me for many, many years, and it was always a hit at every party I ever had, now veganized for everyone to enjoy. Check out how to make them. You will need fresh parsley, garlic, onion, celery, salt and pepper, vegan sausage, dried thyme and sage, vegan butter, vegan cream cheese, vegan parmesan cheese, and breadcrumbs, and of course mushrooms. Check out the size of these bad boys. They were huge and I just couldn't pass them up. Normally I buy smaller ones for parties that require finger type foods, but I've also served these mushrooms as a main course or a larger single serving appetizer. You can really choose whatever size works best for you and your party. So first divide the butter in half and use about one tablespoon of it to coat the bottom of a nine by 13 inch cake pan. Okay, who am I kidding? Your hands are your best tools, so just get in there. Arrange the de-stemmed mushrooms in the pan and then you're going to make the stuffing. Combine the parsley, onion, garlic, and celery in a food processor, including the stems from the mushrooms that you've hollowed out, and then process everything to a hash-like consistency. Next, get the vegan sausage to a saute pan and cook it over high heat until it's browned. I don't use any oil because it will prevent this sausage from browning properly. So don't worry about a dry cook, just keep it moving around. Add the veggie hash and then cook everything about two to three minutes. Add the sage and the thyme and then lower the heat to low and add the vegan cream cheese. Mix everything until it's really well combined and then add the breadcrumbs and the Parmesan cheese. Salt and pepper to taste and you're ready to stuff your mushrooms. This recipe is going to make about six to eight jumbo mushrooms like the biggest one that I have here or 18 smaller ones. But since I have a bunch of different sizes, I actually got nine exactly. It is a good idea to have all the same size mushrooms since they will bake at the same rate that way. Plus it just looks nicer when you plate them up. But I just went with this pre-packaged one that I found at the store and of course they hid all the small ones on the bottom. Anyway, sprinkle the tops with some Parmesan cheese and then top each mushroom with a spot of the remaining vegan butter. You can also melt that remaining tablespoon of butter and just brush it over each one and probably that would be a little bit easier. Bake in a preheated 350 degree Fahrenheit oven for 25 minutes and they were all perfectly cooked. my signature parsley plate garnish from the 80s. I know some of you cringe when I do that, but hey, what can I say? Well, you are ready to rock and roll with big juicy mushrooms stuffed with vegan sausage and believe me, just packed with so much flavor. You will wow all your friends, vegan or not, with this recipe. I love making these for all my parties or just to have for dinner or a snack. I think you will love them too, so I hope you will try it for your next party or just if you want to eat something amazing for dinner. In keeping with the stuffed theme, a really great dessert option to go along with this dish would be my chocolate chip cookie dough stuffed brownies. So head on over to Gretchen'sVeganBakery.com to grab all the recipes. If you liked this video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up and also subscribe here to my channel if you're not already. Alright, thanks to everyone for watching and if you like this food series addition to my regular baking channel, comment below. Thanks to everyone for being here with me and until next time, happy vegan cooking and baking. Bye for now. Oh, and happy new year if you're watching this in December of 2017. Alright, I'll see you guys soon.